Hi guys. Welcome to my channel. Before we get started. Make sure to hit that like button. Also subscribe to my channel. Dealing with difficult people. So make sure to watch the full video. Doesn't it seem like we manage troublesome individuals in practically all periods of our lives? I frequently needed to manage troublesome individuals at work all through my profession. Some of the time it's been my boss, different times it's been my kindred partners and, surprisingly, different times, it's kin in different divisions. Then there are our families. I know not simply my family can be very challenging to manage. I've heard an adequate number of stories from companions to realize that a many individuals' families push them to the edge occasionally. Also, I could go on and on about managing the large numbers of individuals we need to manage at organizations we associate with. Be it the PDA organization or the individual that should fix my rooftop last year. I needed to follow up each week for very nearly four months before they at last came and fixed something that ought to have been finished in any case. For what reason was that so troublesome? There's most likely not a simple response for why certain individuals are challenging to manage. The reasons are however different as individuals may be. We are unique and in some cases, it's stunning that we get along as well as we do. Rather than breaking down why certain individuals can be so troublesome, we should zero in on what we have some control over, our responses. We should take a gander at 10 master procedures to manage troublesome individuals. Number 1. Use lots of kindness. See, I get it. While managing troublesome individuals, the stomach response is to be troublesome right back. At the point when it seems like somebody is going after you, your most memorable idea is to safeguard yourself. I've been there yet become involved with that when I don't dial back and take a delay. What I have found in pretty much every tough spot is generosity goes significantly farther than being troublesome. Whenever two individuals are being troublesome with one another, the circumstance will in general raise to where nothing will get achieved. Then again, when you utilize bunches of benevolence with a troublesome individual ordinarily, it diffuses what is happening and you get a greater amount of what you need. This is one of the top procedures for managing troublesome individuals. Number 2. Be compassionate. Heard that truism about managing your own concerns? That assuming you and a lot of individuals pushed every one of your concerns into a circle that you'd in all likelihood take your own back once you saw every other person's? That's what I love. The fact of the matter is not a single one of us truly understand what others are going through. While managing a troublesome individual, it very well may be they are going through an exceptionally extreme difficulty, or managing a huge issue you wouldn't need any piece of. Ordinarily when you show empathy to an individual who is being troublesome, you'll find they answer in a positive way. So many of us stall out in our own heads and in our own lives that we don't open our eyes to when others could utilize some generosity. Check it out the following time you consider it. Number 3. Find something in common. At any point saw how while you're conversing with somebody interestingly, finding something in like manner makes areas of strength for an association? We as a whole love to feel like piece of a gathering, similar to we have a place. This is an extraordinary master procedure to manage troublesome individuals and one you ought to keep top of psyche. It's generally good to figure out we went to a similar college as somebody, it makes a sort of connection. My girls are the two youngsters now yet I used to feel a parental bond with somebody when I figured out my girls went to similar school as their children. At the point when we can find something in a similar manner as a troublesome individual, it can help make for a smoother discussion a while later. Number 4. Stay calm. Have you at any point got an email from a co-worker that quickly made them see red? This has happened to me on additional events than I want to recollect. Working with a troublesome individual on an undertaking can chafe. At my less judicious minutes, I've gotten an email from a troublesome individual whose main reason is by all accounts making things harder and seriously confounding. At the point when I haven't stopped prior to answering what typically happens is, I shoot an email that will just compound the situation. Normally, in the event that I can track down the persistence to keep even tempered and stand by some time prior to answering, the outcomes are vastly improved. The capacity to remain composed while managing a troublesome individual will help you incredibly. 5. Share your side. Once in a while, having the option to eloquent to a troublesome individual where you are coming from will have a major effect. For example, in the event that you've been pursuing into block facade block facade and the troublesome individual is your last road for goal, at times that has an effect. Certain individuals get found out in a standard content of how to bargain in specific circumstances or when somebody poses a specific inquiry. In the event that you can give some setting around your particular circumstance, in some cases that has an immense effect. You could tell them you've attempting to take care of your concern for a really long time and you've attempted X, Y, and Z yet can't go away any place. 
Some of the time this is everything necessary to open the compassion entryways somewhat and get some assistance. Try it out. Number 6. Approach with deference. I don't have the foggiest idea about a solitary individual who likes to be dealt with like they are dumb or clumsy. While managing a troublesome individual, consistently make sure to approach them with deference. When you begin going after somebody and behaving like they are inept you should forcibly close the way to finish anything. Treating somebody rudely will quite often compound the situation and at an absolute minimum make the other individual not have any desire to effectively help you. It's equivalent to recollecting the brilliant rule treat others as you might want to be dealt with. Our moms are quite often right. Number 7. Overlook them. I'm a tremendous defender of not communicating with gloomy individuals in my day-to-day -day existence. All they appear to do is give negative information and I needn't bother with any of that. All the same, once in a while the best strategy with a troublesome individual is to overlook or stay away from them. This obviously will depend on the off chance that you can disregard them. For example assuming this is an individual colleague that you don't need to work with a lot, it could be ideal to just overlook them if possible. Same thing with neighbors or certain individuals at stores or even possibly clients. Once in a while troublesome clients are essentially not worth managing. Their necessities could be better off somewhere else and it's not generally an impractical notion to tell them they could presumably find another person who could help them in the manner they are needing. Number 8. Control whatever might be possible. Numerous things in life we have some control over and numerous things we can't. Zeroing in on what we have some control over is in every case best. While managing a troublesome individual, contemplate what you can handle. Perhaps there's another person you can manage rather than the troublesome individual. They might be just the most vital phase in the chain. As of late, I was endeavoring to work with a promoting division on another drive I was assembling. I was told to contact someone in particular for help since that had forever been finished. At the point when I reached the individual, I never got a reaction. I sent different messages and left a few voice messages and never heard back from this individual. Subsequent to getting very baffled from never hearing back, I basically began asking others in showcasing. A modern day miracle, I found a few group that were ready to assist me with my task and with a grin. I fundamentally worked my strategy for getting around the troublesome individual control your best. Number 9. Check yourself out. Another of the 10 master procedures to manage troublesome individuals is to investigate yourself. As thusly your concentrate internal. Is there something that you are doing that is making managing somebody harder than it should be? For example as a general rule, I'm feeling very great. I cooperate with individuals the entire day practically regular and generally, it goes reasonably without a hitch. Now and then, I have a great deal of my psyche and am attempting to tackle an issue or the like inside my head, in any event, while conversing with others. It has been brought up to me that I can seem to be short, unexpected, and stooping when I'm investing a ton of energy inside my own head and furthermore connecting with others. So in this example, my short stooping reactions can make a generally disturbed individual much more surprised. Fundamentally the manner in which I answer is stoking the fire. Investigate how you are interfacing with troublesome individuals to guarantee you're not aggravating it. Number 10. Conquer your feeling of dread toward struggle. One of the most mind-blowing strategies for managing troublesome individuals is conquering your anxiety toward struggle. Many individuals fear clashes and this can prompt having troublesome individuals mistreat them. Managing a troublesome individual is testing enough however on the off potential for success that you don't have up for you and lay out limits, it's much more dreadful. Essentially everybody should be treated with deference. Try not to permit yourself to be dealt with ineffectively by a troublesome individual. I'm not supporting purposefully beginning clash. What I'm supporting isn't dreading struggle in the occasion a troublesome individual is mistreating you. Such a large number of individuals permit others to have command over them by not defending themselves when required. Struggle isn't really something terrible. In many examples, it's great since it can permit a goal to happen as expected, how to transform any contentions into potential open doors. Conclusion Troublesome individuals are surrounding us in each part of our lives. I've positively worked with numerous troublesome individuals over the course of the years as well as in regular cooperations with individuals in a wide assortment of settings. I'm confident these 10 master procedures to manage troublesome individuals will help you the following time what is going on emerges. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video make sure to hit that like button. Also subscribe to our channel before you go.